Yeah, like I just know my reaction yeah. is my little girl reaction and not my like adult reaction. So I'm always, and that's pretty much, I would say the answer to, to what, I mean, what to do with almost every reaction you have is like, give it a minute. Like my big problem was being so reactive. And as long as you sit and go, okay, is this something, you know, like, am I being jealous right now? Am I being insecure? What What is the issue here? And then identifying it and then not acting on it going, mm -hmm. oh, that's, that's that. That's not what's happening. I think that's what's so interesting about the word anxiety is I think people think it means, oh, I'm nervous, you know, and you're biting your nails. But, <laughs> you know, it's for me, I, I realized that, well, OK, I don't really have my fear of flying anymore and I don't mind being alone. I'm, I do a lot of things. I don't really know what I'm anxious about, but I'm reactive or I was reactive. And, you know, that is a form of anxiety. And so if we just blanket everything as anxiety, you know, it's important to talk about the deeper things. Like you mentioned the word deliberation, that's a form of anxiety, but reactivity is huge. And I think it's what tanks a lot of relationships because I think, you know, for me, I was never taught that you can't just react however you want without taking a minute and that the other person, it may chip away at their love for you. I really didn't know that. I thought you could just act however, and people had to love you unconditionally, you know? <laughs> yeah, well, that would be ideal, right? You could just, and that way we wouldn't have the annoyances we have when dealing with people who don't seem exactly the same way or operate in the way we would. It, you know, if everyone could just react and not take it personally, great. 